Annie's brother jumped off a cliff. She went to claim the body. He removes the cloth, and her brother's spirit appears. Grace, it's not safe here. Hey! The next moment. Annie collapses, and the nuns take her to rest. Annie thinks the nuns are sneaking around. They all say Mike jumped off the cliff and died on the beach. But Mike's hair was so clean, there wasn't even a grain of sand in it. The priest explained that Mother Superior had cleaned up the body to make it easier for the police to investigate. But Annie was still suspicious. She went to the place where Mike had jumped off the cliff. There was a stone house. Annie went over and saw one of the nuns jump off the rock and die. Even more bizarrely, Several other nuns jumped to their deaths. At this sight, Annie frowned and fell into the sea. But just as Anne was about to drown, she was rescued. She was taken back to the convent to recuperate. But it was a dreary place. It was a palace, but there weren't many nuns. The mother superior, an old woman in menopause, persuaded Anne to stay. 